Hello, hello, it's Simone. I'm back with the last video for my teeny tiny mini series on this mini album. And I'm just going to flip through and show you what I did. I have this ribbon that I will be sewing to the back here, that I will sew here, and then I will t wrap it around and um, tie a, a bow here at the edge. So, um, I will still need to go through and see whether there are um, letter stickers that need gluing. This is the title page. It says, enjoy June 2016 Besuch in Santa Clara, meaning visit to Santa Clara. Um, and then I already flip through this and I will not go into too much detail just show you what it looks like so this is strange it's clear this is the way it looks okay now this is when they got here what we did during two three weeks of my mom and my sister and her family visiting us um, I have this flip out here added embellishments stamping And you can see that not all pages look the same. I used, uh, I will link the videos before. There are two process videos and one um, kit video where you can see the supplies that I used. Um, I tried to um, spread them throughout the whole mini album and use the same papers. And I think I got it um, quite cohesive, quite a cohesive look. Some of the photos you might notice are very dark and um, if you saw the first video I said it before, I um, just printed the photos that I helped me tell the story. I did not um, edit them too much because um, I wanted this to be a journal about the time and the trip and not to have the well, pretty photos are good, but um, I just didn't want to spend too much time and they were okay and helping me tell the story. So that's why some of the photos are so dark. I really, really love this page. And this one. This is a stamp set from Studio Calico that I think is from February or January 2015. And this is also a Studio Calico stamp set. This was a very hard page for me to make because I fought that day had a big fight with my husband that day and didn't enjoy it so I wasn't it it actually really reflects in the way I embellished and journaled I just did this before uh, filming it was plain before but well yeah maybe that's just the way it is then here this is the only three by four photo all of the others are either two by two by two or two by three yeah the only thing that I really regret is I have two photos of my mom and both times we are taking the photo against the sun and there's shadow on her face and yeah that's not really what I wanted to have okay so I had a really hard time using this watermelon. I wanted to use it here because we made this awesome watermelon salad, but it just didn't really work. And then this is saying goodbye, sending them back to Germany. And on the last page, I took a photo of myself. It's from last week. And I wrote a tiny letter to my mom and yeah, it says 
the end I still had some letter letter stickers left and I just liked that there is something on the back so yeah thank you so much for taking the time and watching my video and if you don't want to miss videos like this subscribe to my channel um, I hope this was inspiring to you. I really love how it turned out and I really hope that my mom will love it as much as I do. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!